This video further examines the attributes of the merge node and the use of multiple merges in the design of Smart Photo Editor effects. The video gets straight to the point, so let's look at an effect structure designed to explore the possibilities of multiple merge techniques. The first step arose by trying to consider what would happen if you created a path starting with the application of Gaussian blur. But rather than merging it up with the original image, create two distinct paths by merging the Gaussian blur output with itself, twice in fact as shown. The idea was then to merge both these paths back into one path. The choice of merge modes was not entirely arbitrary, but the process was interactive. In other words, we made incremental adjustments until we arrived at the result achieved in the last merge. The hope was that a funky image would emerge, and this seems to be the case. After this was achieved, it was hoped that the effect structure could be developed by creating new paths from the original image and merging it with the funky image output from the first stage of the process. As the effect was being developed, an idea presented itself. The idea was to have an early merge on the first new path by merging the first Gaussian blur merge output with that of the original image. This was done as shown. It became obvious to now merge the funky image output with the merge we have just made. Again, after a bit of tweaking and selection of merge modes, a very interesting effect started to appear. The last bit of refinement was based on trying to keep the black in our effect and make the effect a little more subtle. Hence, we merged the last output result with the original image again to create a quite striking result. We added a tone node to give users more control over the effect should it be published. In fact, we tweaked the final result by increasing brightness, etc. The design concept started off by considering what-if questions and through a process of incremental changes to node parameters, a credible and valid effect has been created. Does the effect have generic application? Well, it has been tested with other images, but not necessarily with as good a result. Hence, the author has not published it yet as there might be room for improvement. This video outlines an interesting and relatively natural way of building effects. Sometimes you know exactly what you're trying to achieve and know how to achieve it. But more often than not, little surprises take you in new directions and increase the effect possibilities. Other than using Gaussian blur at the beginning and introducing tone controls at the end, this effect has been wholly created by simply using merge nodes in a creative manner. This is a good example of the amazing power of multiple merge-based effects. In the meantime, good luck and have fun!